Oh, it's a smally. Oh, dudes. I got four in the morning. I heard. I, it was so freaky. I woke up. I'm waiting for my coffee. Yeah, okay. Uh, I woke up to the sound of screeching tire. <laughs> Uh, and my, my inside, I saw a car spinning around. Boom! Uh huh. A crash. A crash. You are coming to you. Who's crashing? You and me. Uh huh. So I think I might have. Uh, and then I was like, boom! So I live right next to. 35W, well, the exit ramp up 35W, and occasionally I do hear some big car crashes. Uh, I heard one, I, I think I was uh, mm, clearing out, yeah. This big crash I heard uh, a while back, yeah. Uh, Years back, yeah, pretty freaky. I heard a huge crash, shook my whole house. Yeah, uh, ran out, called 911. I saw somebody scream, Call 911! Yeah, uh, ran out. Uh, my neighbor came over, a renter, I said, What was that? I, uh, did your house shake? That's how hard the crash was. Yeah, it turned out it was a drunk driver driving the wrong way on 35W and then ran into a kid of a kid. I hear a kid of four years old. Uh huh. This isn't predictive, this is clearing out old energy. Mm hmm. Ran into a uh, family of some kids who had, uh, they were just leaving their parents' house. They, I think they had celebrated their parents' anniversary or something like that. Yeah, dead. We ran out, ran down there. Cops came, it was horrific. Uh, an automated car might mean something. I hear, here I come to save the day. Yes, all right. Mm -hmm. Okay. What is your opinion, darling? What is my opinion? Oh, interesting. What is my opinion on Elon Musk buying Twitter? Okay. Lex Friedman interviewing Kanye West. Okay. Oh, it's a big one. First of all, Elon Musk is a super empath. No doubt about it. Yeah. Uh, we have to remember, super empaths uh, are, are people, too. Yeah. Might get a little triggered sometimes, say some weird shit. Yeah. Uh, people don't understand that Elon... Uh, Elon had, I mean, he talks about it. He had his first awakening at you know, like eight years old. He called it uh, his existential crisis. Can you imagine that being that powerful of an empath? Uh, that much? Uh -huh. He's a little white dove, yeah? Uh, mm hmm. That when you're, when you're that far of an empath who may not have been able, and he's a high priest, okay? may not have been able to harness that energy properly. Mm -hmm. I heard a star baby. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you attract uh, the super empaths. That's like a magnet. Uh -huh. Will attract this, this low vibe. They're like uh, a light. Uh, I see like a bug zapper. Uh -huh. Ooh, bzz, bzz, bzz. In the darkness is the is the uh, I hear the cadence, okay, the feel of this mm, this sort of person, yes. So just even to uh, 
Mm -hmm. Now, I don't agree with some things that, uh, for the record, me personally, Molly, I don't agree with some of the political uh, things uh, that he made back. Uh, mm -hmm. But I do agree with a lot of other things, yeah. And uh, I may need to speak speak with someone. See, that's why I'm like, I'm not like, fuck you, dude. I don't agree with everything you say. Yeah, because you'll never learn if you're that way. If you only hang out with a small nucleus of people who think the exact same as you on every uh -huh, tangent, I hear. I hear a tanager. Yeah. Nobody's going anywhere. You're all stuck in a birdcage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, I believe Elon, yeah, uh -huh, will create this platform, a new platform. Uh, X, whatever he's planning on calling it, yeah. Uh, let everybody say what they want to say. Yeah. Oh, how dare they? No, let that motherfucker, whoever it is on the platform, say whatever they want to say. Let's take all the masks off so everybody can truly see how low they go or how high. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah, free speech, man. Yeah, let them all dig their own graves. Uh-huh. Or ride the elevator straight to the top. Yeah. Somebody might get Willy Wonka's chocolate factory. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Or wake up. Grab your bags. California's burning to the ground. Wake up. Grab your bags. Huh? Bags? I hear the baggage claim. You and I are leaving Los Angeles. Okay. Smoke or fire? Yeah. Okay. Somebody's trying to figure out what the fuck. Okay. Kanye West with Lex Friedman. Wonderful interview. Yeah. Way to do it, Lex. Yeah. Uh-huh. I don't know much about Lex Friedman. I just recently found him. Uh -huh. Online, yeah, I've been starting to listen to his stuff. Mm hmm. Admire the dude, yeah. Very smart, intelligent. Uh -huh. I heard intelligent. Uh -huh. That's what I meant. Intelligent dude, yeah. Uh huh. All right. Also, highly sensitive, super empath. Yeah. Genius, yeah. All right. And a snazzy dresser. To boot. Uh-huh. Right? It's not sweet she licks. Sasha. I heard Sasha. Mm-hmm. So, uh, I watched the, the interview with Kanye and Lex. Uh, I tip my hat to Lex. Yeah, because that was a tough one. Yeah, he was like literally trying to interview a wild horse. Mm -hmm. So, I hear the horse whisper. Mm -hmm. So, Kanye West, yeah, what's my thoughts on that? Uh huh. I personally believe, well, just from my observation, yeah, uh, that Kanye just said whatever he needed to say to cut all the contracts. I think he, he looked, it sounds like he's bored, mm -hmm. uh, stuck, uh, respectfully said, you know, sorry, not sorry is the truth, yeah, not flowing properly, no, uh, I think he has a crusty heart chakra, yeah, uh, so I think what Kanye did was, uh, There's a bunch of things that are going on when I, my observation was his wheels are spinning super fast. Yeah. And he, and it's like his head is way above what he can articulate. Yeah. All right. Uh huh. That's like, uh, I would respectfully say, you know, like genius level spectrum stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, and he is a very intelligent man. 
is. But I don't know. I can't tell. It's, mu it's muddy and hazy. It doesn't appear he was flowing properly. No, because he just said whatever he needed to say to cut all contracts. Yep. Uh huh. Now, yeah, no, I'm not tied to anybody. Mm -hmm. What do you think of that? Yeah. The whole world was like, oh! Yeah. What? You went that low? Yeah. Mm hmm? I think Kanye respectfully said, uh, could, maybe, could maybe benefit from, uh, we just saw his crash, yeah. Uh, first of all, he needs to th stop and think about why he takes a giant shit in every Divine Feminine's punch bowl, yeah. Lizzo, yeah, she's killing it, yeah. Uh huh. What the world needs now, yeah, is a big black divine feminine energy who knows how to twerk. Yeah, I see. I uh, I heard viral. Okay, I I saw a fertility goddess. Yeah, I had the fetish. Okay, like a uh, little fertility goddess. Uh, Lizzo is definitely in her divine feminine energy for sure. Yeah. Uh, most of the fertility goddesses are uh, luxurious, big mama, uh, mm, energy. Yeah. A bosom for everyone. Yeah. What the world needs now is Lizzo uh -huh, twerking, playing crystal flutes. Yeah. And healing everybody with her self confidence, self assuredness. Her joking ability. She's a comedian at heart. Uh -huh. I had the master of ceremonies. She started succeeding. She's succeeding. She's getting her karmic rewards are coming in for sure. She's got this great Yiddies line. Uh, her new uh, her onesie. Yeah. Went a little hard on the booty. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, all that is helping people all over the world to send up. And he, and he just. Uh, I don't want to be. I don't want to just like come into this talking bunch of trash about Kanye because I believe he removed his heart from the situation. Mm hmm. And just said, I'm going to go for it. I'm just going to say whatever I need to say to cut all contracts. Yeah. Uh, well. Mm hmm. That's a race to the top. Yeah. And that's hardcore because it can cause a lot of damage. I don't want you to say. Now I hear that crash. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I watched Lex. Uh huh. What a professional he is. Yes. Highly intelligent. Clearly enlightened. Uh -huh. I have poked the bear. Mm -hmm. Uh, Lex flowed through that whole interview. Yeah. Uh, but I did notice he, it, the amount of self restraint he had to have, he had to keep a professional while constantly, yeah, getting dissed. Yeah. And uh, Kanye's inability to self reflect and see what he was doing it was troubling. Yeah. I was like, oh no. Yeah. But I also had a great ad. Admiration, yes, for the interviewer, yes, because the minute he got close to something, yeah, a nerve or something, yeah, you could see, mm hmm, Kanye, mm hmm, you could feel it, all the super empaths could feel it, yeah. Oh, you can't piss him off or he's gonna have a tantrum and walk out, mm hmm. 
he can say whatever he wants to say. But if you uh, try to respectfully engage in debate back, uh -huh, he got all triggered. Yeah. And Lex was trying. He was like, I'm giving you a hand, man. Yeah, come to the other side of the river. And it just seemed like Kanye was uh, being a bitch because he could be. Mm -hmm. The person I'm being in is an intelligent person. Yeah, that's unenlightened right now. Mm -hmm. Talking about being the prophet, a Christian, all this stuff. And then remember, Christianity uh, is a religion. Yeah, that's down here. All us ascended beings that are flowing are into spirituality which is like just one tier above yeah mm -hmm. and everybody's like oh. Oh. yeah yeah remember he had to take a big shit in taylor swiss uh, swiss i hear the swiss miss yeah and taylor swift's punch bowl too this is divine feminine energy that's getting accolades awards Something like that. Mm-hmm. And he comes and shits in the punch ball because he's bored. He has something to say. Mm-hmm. So, uh, he really went for it. I don't give a fuck. I'll say whatever I want to say. Yeah, I'm ending all my contracts with people. I'm going to be free agent, do whatever I want now. Uh huh. Oppression. Yeah. Well, uh, I can see that uh, it may seem like a wise and swift business move. Yeah. So, what I saw was somebody who removed their heart. Yeah. I'm just said, yeah, watch what watch what I'm gonna do. Yeah. Mm hmm I'm bored. I made all the money in the world. Yeah. Mm hmm I made weird looking shoes. Yeah. People buy a lot of money for. Yeah. I hear the class clown. Mm hmm now I want the fame and recognition all to myself and all of the money. No more oppression for me. Oh. Mm -hmm. So when that happened, I hear Kirby enthusiasm. Mm -hmm. When that happened, when he just said whatever he wanted to say because his heart was removed from the situation. Mm-hmm. It caused a whole bunch of towers. Yeah. F the Jewish community, for sure. Uh huh. Other empaths are like, what the fuck? Yeah. What? Uh huh. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Took a lot of balls to do what he did. Uh, there's that. Yeah. You might lose your whole fucking empire. A respect from everybody but your faux soul advisors who are uh, narcissists. Yeah. Mm hmm But the towers it created. Uh -huh. Oh, everybody got triggered after hearing ha Kanye. Ha uh -huh. Han Hane. Hana. Hono. The Honu. Okay. It's a sea turtle. Represents family. Okay. Everybody heard that? Oh, got triggered. Yeah. Heart chakras open, open, open collectively. And a whole bunch of the collective consciousness uh, rose. So he might have mm -hmm, been acting as a dark angel to trigger a bunch of people to ascend up collectively. Mm -hmm. Whatever it is, it worked. Uh, the rest of the collective gathered together, like their wounds together. I firmly believe no man left behind, or woman, uh -huh, or however you identify. Yeah. 
Uh, so I can't tell if, uh, is that a point where we just don't give a shit? Mm -hmm. the, that heart chakra <laughs> closed. Mm -hmm. I can't tell if he, uh, it's not, it's like, it's not a, really artistic, those kind of moves. That's low hanging fruit. Yeah. Just being a bitch because you can. And he was clearly doing that. Yeah, if Lex got close to anything, you could see him get starting to get triggered. And it was very apparent. You piss me off, I'm leaving. Uh, you piss me off, I'm going to huff up. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sorry, not sorry. It's the truth. It's what happened. Uh, he, may, he might have spent a lot of time. There's these big daddies, big mamas, who spent a lot of time of their life now. Hearing everybody say yes, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. These big, big bobblehead things. Everybody says yes to me because I'm a prophet. Yeah, no, they're just sucking your dick because you got a lot of money. Mm -hmm. I saw Lex uh, legit get sad. Uh, uh huh. When Kanye was just like so disrespectful to all, I don't trust you. you know? Oh, yeah. That's a close heart chakra. Yeah. Uh, I, I can't imagine how I felt for Elon. Yeah, you're Kanye West. I don't trust anybody. Yeah, when he was spouting out weird shit, you know, who stood by his side? His old friend. Yeah. Uh, what does that say about Elon? Well, mm -hmm. do you automatically. Uh, if you stand by somebody who's, what the fuck are you doing? Yeah. But if you stand by them because they're your friend, mm -hmm. even when I know I'm wrong, mm -hmm. even when you know I'm wrong, will you stand, will you stand by me? Yeah. Mm hmm. Elon twittered out, yeah. I express my concerns, yeah. I believe Elon went to a Jewish school. I, I think I read that somewhere when he was a kid. Mm -hmm. uh, that must have hurt to hear that kind of stuff, yeah. <gasps> yeah, but I think Kanye is trying to process these uh, high-level thoughts that his brain is trying to do. It's like he's an engine, but uh, it's like mi I am misfiring, yeah. Mm -hmm. He needs to uh, hang out with some divine feminine energy, mm -hmm. in my humble opinion, mm -hmm. and, get, and get back on track, because he's either super flea-ridden right now, super flea-ridden, flea yeah, or he's crossed over and became one of them. Mm-hmm. But I did see uh, in that interview an amazingly talented man, Lex Friedman. Oh my God, what a professional. And a little cutie pie too, yeah. Looking all dapper, yeah. I poked around his channel. Yeah, if you don't listen to him, you should, yeah. He has a really intelligent mind. Uh, MIT, I hear. Mm -hmm. I hear I just saw the letters NXT next, MIT next. Somebody go, may go to MIT. Mm -hmm. Electric vehicles, I hear. Artificial intelligence. Mm -hmm. I hear Fleet the Farm. There's a, a store here in Minnesota called Fleet Farm. Yeah. Uh -huh. Some of may get like work boots, steel toe work boots, or Timberland. <laughs> We're going into the Timberland. All right. Wanna go for a ride? All right. Mm hmm.
I hear, okay, I hear a librarian at the Akashic Records. For the Akashic Record, it totally happened. Uh-huh. Alright, I hear the horse whisper. Okay, so Lex can transmute energy. He's a super empath, yeah. Alright. If something's starting to get out of control, I can uh, take the energy and uh, calm it down. I hear the horse whisper, the wild horse whisper. Yeah. So that's somebody who has worked on the ego. Because he could have got triggered like a motherfucker and told Conway to. Conway? Uh huh. I hear Amway. I hear Go. Yeah, the movie Go. Genius. That was a great movie. Uh huh. I hear. Uh huh. Somebody may have looked at a cat and it was a Chinese emperor. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, all these big daddies are sending up super fast. Yeah, they're choosing to walk in the light. Spirit's going to send in karmic rewards. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And everybody was hoping. Yeah, well, time will tell. We'll see what Kanye does, what his, what his deal is. Mm-hmm. Everybody was like, oh, oh, oh. Mm. Come to the other side of the river, man. Uh, yeah, what? Yeah. Imagine, I hear, you're being a bitch just to be a bitch. Yeah. Imagine if you harness that energy, start flowing correctly, uh, and doing true light work. The power. Yeah. All right. I heard no man left behind. I see somebody, yeah. In a, in a war outfit, okay. And a helmet. I've got a gun. It's like Forrest Gump. I see Forrest Gump running the uh huh. The hurt people back to where, uh huh, where the helicopter is. Yeah. Will they make it? I don't know. We can't force people to ascend up. No. We can't force them to walk in the light, no. As light workers, we can show them the way, yeah? We can say, here is the way. But friend, I'm not gonna sit here at the crossroads waiting for you to decide what you're gonna do, no. I myself, as the, as the light keeper, have a journey of my own, uh-huh. I have further up the road, further up the road. I'll meet you further on up the road. Mm -hmm. Darling, the light keeper always has to move up the road. They're keeping the light. They're the trailblazers. Yes. For the day is dark and the night is cold. I'll meet you further on up the road. Mm -hmm. Somebody may be moving. From Grossville, in the Healdville, yeah, where their true soul family is, their soul tribe, the people that vibrate on the same vibration, yes, the cosmic lovers who love everyone, everyone is their tribe, yes, I will give you a chance, yes, those are the super empaths, yes, I trust you, yes. So we have to be careful with that, yes, because we want to see the good in everyone. We want to see that everybody tries as hard as we do to ascend up, yes. But part of that veil for a light worker in getting removed is seeing that some people may choose not to. And so it's our own test as light workers, yes. Are we going to stay stuck doing someone else's comic homework? Are we going to move forward in our own path of enlightenment? There's never an end of the enlightenment, darling. No, you just keep expanding more and more. Yes. So, with Conway, yeah, we'll see what happens. He needs his heart chakra open and he needs to flow properly. Yes, he's misfiring. Hmm. His contract with Kim is over, yes. She had a divine counterpart in Pete, yes. 
uh, something to do with, okay, my headphones just, um, were, oh, 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 they ran out of battery, yes, she has some sort of contract with Pete, yes, uh, for them to split, they had star babies, Kanye and Kim had star babies, they had to make, <laughs> yes, and now their contract is over, but he's stuck, yes, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, Unrequited love, yes. Kim and Kim and Pete's staircase is already moved. Yes, they're on to new. Yeah, and Kim and Pete's con so Kim and Pete had a contract. Yes, Pete is also a super empath. Kim Kardashian is a super empath muse. All of those girls are, and Robert, I hear. Yes, it runs through the mother's bloodline, so it doesn't matter who's the father of those children. No, it all runs through Kris Jenner's bloodline. Uh, or Kardashian, however she goes now. Mm -hmm. Super empath muses. So all of those, I'll call them Kardashians, yes, but that does include Kylie and Kendall, yes. Our divine feminine muses. Mm -hmm. For sure in their divine purpose. Mm hmm I hear spectacular. Okay, so spectrum, spectacular. I heard combined. Genius level. Yes. Spirit sending Pete mm -mm, to help her and the contract with him, with Kanye. Yeah. And then Pete and Kim's contract's over. Pete's on to somebody else. A new divine counterpart is working out for him. Kim is doing her. Oh. Mm hmm. Her thing. Kanye's still stuck, yeah. Uh, he's still not realizing that contract is over. And he's stuck in some sort of unrequited love worship thing. Mm -hmm. Here, I extend a helping hand. Don't bite the hand that feeds you, darling. Who are you? Who are you? Mm -hmm. So I'm excited, yes, to use Elon Musk's new platform. Mm -hmm. Oh, he didn't forget about the little guys. No. So I would love to run my tarot channel. It's going to be like X or something like that, I'm sure. Uh -huh. On his platform, whatever he turns it into. Mm <clears throat> Yeah, he will expand it for not just the platform to make money off advisors, uh -huh, advertisement, that kind of thing. He will also, yes, make it so the individual can make money. It would be the perfect platform for what I'm doing. See, mm -hmm, my my purpose, yes, is to highlight the musicians, the actors, yes, artists, yes, ah. Oh. So in my vision, there's some platform out there where I can do my transmissions, yes. And Elon's divine mission, what am I hoping to make that platform? Can you even believe that? So we can set off a little white ducks free. Yes. So whatever bands I link to, yes. Uh, somehow there will be some sort of button, tip button, something or other. Yes. Download now and the artist will get 100% of the profits. Something along that line. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. The spirit is sending in the head librarian. Yes, blessings go to the rightful receiver, darling. Yes. So I'm setting up this whole thing. So everybody who gets highlighted by spirit gets a comic reward. Ability. Yes. To be seen. Yes. To get a massive tip coming in over and over and over. A miracle being brought in. Something along that, yes. And darling, let's let people say whatever they want to say. Let's see what they say when they get triggered. Do they come around and say, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that? Uh -huh. Do we watch somebody just say a blanket statement? Yes. And then watch everybody else get oh, triggered? Yeah. Let people say what they want to say. Let them remove their own masks. 
So yes, the whole collective consciousness can see what we're dealing with. Mm -hmm. He said in his his letter there will be different parts of the the platform, all different things that can be done. People might be having great big paradigm shifts about how they're receiving information. They may be realizing how much things are getting filtered through their own filter and distorting reality. Mm -hmm. Somebody, mm -hmm. I hear somebody may see the super start. Uh, I hear start. It starts with the Starks. I just heard it starts with the Starks. Yeah. A good man. Or a good woman. Yeah, we might have some good men and good women coming together to raise the collective consciousness. Mm hmm. So, Kanye, uh, with this, I heard this stunt he did. Uh, cause massive towers all over. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like some dark angel energy. Yeah. But it woke a bunch of people up. Had a bunch of people said, whoa, all at the same time. Mm hmm. I guess we'll I guess we'll just see what happens. See where he takes it from here. Did he lose in his his entire empire? I hear your empire down. Mm -hmm. Did spirit say no soup for you? Yeah, prophet. Christian. Uh, I heard nothing Christian about that. Yeah. No. We have a lot of. Uh, big thinkers here. Mm -hmm. Our great thinkers didn't just stop way back in Roman times. No, they're current. Yeah. 2,000 years now, from now, we'll be hearing about modern day great thinkers. Yeah, same way we hear about ancient great thinkers. Yeah. How did you use your brain, darling? Mm -hmm. Okay, I hear our trans friends. Our trans friends are finally going to get the respect they deserve. All right, now I see Dave Chappelle talking about George Floyd. Mm -hmm. All right, so here's the deal. Yeah, Kanye, I live in Minneapolis. Yeah, that cop evil motherfucker just gotta say it i dealt with that cop my old work dealt with that cop he's a sadist yeah he loved lord and over people that's not the person anyone wants to get behind candace owens yeah mm -mm. that dude was pure evil man and he enjoyed it i came in contact with his energy he laughed on me when i was sobbing uh huh. I had bloody hands. I had just been attacked. And he liked it. It was devil energy. And he told a sobbing woman it took all that time, two phone calls. Mm -hmm. 20 minutes later, however long it was, because he had more important things to do. Uh, Elon, Dave Chappelle. Uh, I, I can't speak for Elon. I know he has a trans daughter. Mm -hmm. I hear he has an ex-wife. Mm -hmm. Elon Musk is a super empath. 
Let's set that record straight. Nobody knows the story of what's going on, what happened. Um, with Vivian. Uh, I do know that. Even before Vivian came out uh, into the media, uh, I was straight at that name specifically. Vivian! Yeah, I had like four readings where Vivian showed up. Uh huh. So our trans friends, you guys, are star seeds. Uh, they come from someplace, something in their DNA. Uh, we're in its purest form. I hear they are a life creature. Yeah. Who changes their uh, genitalia, like their sex, over a single lifetime. So if they, they're born, say, a woman, a girl, a female. Uh-huh. And where that galaxy right here is all right mm -hmm. we have to remember aliens came a long ass time ago long ass time ago we are all mutts we all have a little bit of this dna a little bit of that dna it hasn't been found yet gotta look closer i right hear mm -hmm. trans people are legit old school jedis they took a hardcore mission Legit old school Jedi's doesn't mean you can't have a narcissist trans person because there's definitely those out there. Yeah But uh, A lot of our trans people are super empaths just because of their struggle. Mm-hmm So they were born with that deep yearning Everything in their DNA is saying you have to change you have to go through this change Yeah but they don't have enough of that DNA in them for their body to do it like it was meant to be done. They only have that inkling of it. Yeah, so that that yearning, that knowledge yeah, that I'm in the wrong body, that the metamorphosis is supposed to happen, is absolutely legit. But they're living in a body that doesn't complete the transaction, I hear. That's a hardcore mission, yeah. And our trans friends, yeah, that's somewhere in 40% attempt suicide. 40%. Yeah, if you have a trans kid, yeah, it's, a, uh -huh, it's close to 50. Yeah, 50 50 chance your kid's gonna try to kill themselves. Yeah, so you better fucking love them, accept them for who they are, stop fucking making fun of them. Yeah, we have all these big daddies who are getting more enlightened. Yeah. Uh, making fun of a trans person is no different than being a racist. Yeah. It's the same vibration. It's the exact same vibration. Mm hmm. These are our oldest souls. Yes. I hear that our oldest souls. True Jedi's. Took on a, a hardcore mission. All right. All right. We need to. Mm -hmm. We have enlightenment happening for a bunch of our social leaders. Yeah. Can you imagine telling your strongest Jedi? Yeah, you can't go to the fucking bathroom you need to. Oof. Can you imagine how strong of a Jedi your soul is to even be presented that mission? No man, woman, non-binary, however you identify, left behind, my loves. Unless you have to leave them behind because they refuse to take a step forward. It's a 
that's where we're sitting in our energy. Yes. So we have to remember our light workers are also people. Yes. Having our own triggers, our own hurts. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Our great masters are learning self control. Mm -hmm. An interesting I've no thing I've noticed, yeah, Elon. I've never heard him disparage an ex. Yeah. Mm hmm. I know he did. I read about he did go to court. Yeah, he had some embryos. Uh, I believe with Amber Heard. Yeah, he went to court and said, I don't want to have babies with this person. Yeah, let's destroy these embry embryos. Yeah. Amber one said, no. Yeah. I get embryos. Huh? I heard jackpot. Okay. Can you imagine going to the court as a big daddy saying, I don't want to bring, I don't want to bring a life into the world, yeah, with this person, no, I, can we just like, uh -huh, start at zero, in court saying, oh no, yeah, well, you know, remember, that's life, yeah, uh -huh. You can cut ties with that embryo, but a person gets to keep it. Yeah. Mm. Now they're tied to ya. Energetically. Yeah. I hear oppression. I just heard a reverse rape. Yeah. What do you do? What do you do? I'm a Stacy Channel Oogle. Uh huh. I Google her. I Google her. Somebody may have found somebody's resume. Uh mm huh. -hmm. So, darling, time will tell. Yes, who's on the big train? <laughs> Yes. Whatever it is, we all ascend it together. Yes. In vibration. And darling, yes, I hear Kimbo Musk. Yes. Oh dears. Have you all been seeing this wonderful light shows he's been doing? Yes, I hear Dave Matthews band. Oh yes. The big face of the collective consciousness showed up at the Dave Matthews band concert. Above all the crowd? <gasps> yes. Oh, when the big face of the collective consciousness shows up, <laughs> great things happen for that band. Ooh. 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 Here I am, my brother's keeper. Darling, bros before hoes. Yes, but ladies first. <laughs> Wonderful. Oh, all our light workers are shining bright, darling. Get ready. <laughs> Clean your lens, yes. The true light keepers mm -hmm. are going to start spinning the light all around. Oh, Batman, we need you. Yes, here's the light. Yes, we are the light keepers. Right. What a marvel it's. A marvel. Marvel comics. DC or Marvel? Oh, marvelous! Do we have a Superman here? Or a Superwoman? Or a super person? <laughs> Whatever it all. Uh -huh. Whatever it all, Mae West. Yes. Uh -huh. I choose you. <laughs> all 
right, darling, says your message. Peace out, yes. Uh, obviously, there was no car accident, no. The screeching woke me up. Oh, yes. Don't be scared. It's not a, no, it's not a preventative thing, yes. Just imagine all the electric vehicles, yes, once those are all going properly, yes. That will be a thing of the past. Dirty exhaust blowing in my dad's face so somebody can butt in line in front of him in the airport. Well, I'll be a thing of the past. Yeah. <laughs> Fleet the farm, darling. Peace out. I love you.